Right. Does it work out? No, our friendship is on the mend. It is. Huh? Yeah. All right. Well, thanks for coming in. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> You are adorable. Oh, my yeah, goodness. Oh, thank so you. nice to meet you. Thank you. Um, so tonight's the big, you guys are back. Yes, right it's after our mid season break. Premiere. Hello, uh, Denzel Washington. I know. Is directing you guys? I when know. You heard that, what was that like? Uh, I think everybody died. And then uh, we were all resurrected because we had to come back to work the next day. <laughs> but he's never done TV before. Never, so, But you wouldn't know. You, yeah. you, we absolutely couldn't tell. Uh, it was. It, it, it's really magnificent, you know, somebody of his stature uh, making his direct TV directorial debut with our show is magical, and that's the magic of Shonda Rhimes, that's the magic of Debbie Allen, who's our supervising producer, it was magnificent. We had her on last week, she was doing one of, something for one of her dances, and, and then I, she goes, well, I gotta run, I said, she goes, I'm off to Grey's Anatomy now. I don't know how you all pack it in. That woman has 500 jobs. <laughs> and, and energy for 600. Yeah. Now you, this came to you because you did a role on Scandal. On Scandal, yeah. One scene. One scene. So when you went to do that scene, did you say, this is my audition for Shonda, <laughs> Shonda. for all, everything else, or did, what did you think? No, I actually, I don't think I was aware at that point in time how loyal Shonda Land is. And so for me, that was just, I was happy to be employed. I was mm -hmm. happy to have a job that week, and for it to have turned into, at this point, four years is amazing. Shonda Ying, what is, how does, how does Shonda Ying happen? How does she get all these shows? And, and you, do you all feel the love? We, yeah, definitely, 100%. I don't know how she does it. If I knew how she did it, uh, I would be on my way to building my own empire as we speak. <laughs> and, and, and I have a sense that you will be. Oh, well, I thank you. I think that's where your head is. Am thank I, you. Am I right about that? You're, you're pretty right about oh, that. Okay, all right, all right. Um, do you know Stephanie Edwards? Do I know Stephanie the Edwards? The famous television personality in Los Angeles. Oh. <laughs> do, do you know her? Because you have to say, Do I know her personally? Yeah. Oh, yes, we go way back. No, I would think that she would call and say, hey, you're using my name, right? <laughs> I'm surprised that actually hasn't happened. It will now. Yeah, now. <laughs> After this. Uh, for you, mm -hmm. uh, acting is expression. Mm -hmm. But I, as I said a moment ago, I get a sense you want to do more things. Yeah, you know, I, when I was in college, I studied playwriting and directing, and so I have my hands in that from time to time. I still write and I still direct. Uh, I'm also a photographer and I've got I've got a, a few other irons in the fire as well. It's Aren't nice to have uh, several things that you're that you're good at. You're working on a movie or something now isn't it? Aren't you? I was yeah I was a producer on a film. Mm -hmm. There's it's in post-production now. That's exciting. Yeah it's called Solace. Solace. Yeah. I have a question for you. I noticed that people respond to your character mm -hmm. as if your character is alive. So they attack you personally for uh, things that your character does. Yeah, we all get that. How, how's, <laughs> how strange is that? It is, it's, it's part and parcel of, uh, of being on a show that is, that is so well loved uh, and has such uh, st a strong fan base. Well, yeah, and when McDreamy dies, like, I think everyone yeah. was really worried. Everyone was, well, yeah, they were, they were worried, they were shocked, really. I remember uh, that summer after that aired, I was traveling overseas, and the flight, the flight attendant on one of my flights stopped me, and, like, she wanted to have a 15-minute conversation about why they were upset that that happened, and what we should have done differently, and that... I don't know, I guess all of us were culpable. And you're like, I just want to get to the bathroom. I, yeah, I, I really do. Really <laughs> need to get to the and it's why, why did you do that? Yeah. Why did you do that? Yeah, that's, yes. that's, that's the question. And you sometimes have to say, remember, that's a television show. It's a television show. It's a character. There's a whole room full of people making those decisions, and we just, you know, yeah. we're the faces that, and the bodies See, to carry it out. When you do a show like this, when you do something, mm -hmm. it's me it's being you. a Jack, mm -hmm. you know well, what? Well, no, it could be something. <laughs> yeah, it could be something. Make it out of myself. Really nice uh -huh. as well. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, so where does your character go this year? Well, this year, uh, you get to, she's a very competitive person, mm -hmm. you know, very, very almost Christina Yang in that way, very headstrong and competitive. And so you get to see more of how that uh, causes trouble for her in the workplace and uh, more of how that blurs the line between her and her mentor, Amelia Shepard, who's played by Katerina Scorsoni. Yeah. Okay. Very well said. Mm -hmm. So nice to Thank meet you. For you. Thank yes. you. Grey's Anatomy returns tonight at 8 o'clock on ABC. Does Radio Meredith Radio. survive? That is going to be spectacular. It's okay. all about Meredith. It is. Oh, yeah. It's all about <laughs> Steve. We know that here. <laughs> uh, there's